Welcome back to the channel. Okay, good start. I said an illustrator. Lee, slow down in the workplace. I'm very health and safety conscious. Do not tell me to slow down, Lee. <laughs> no, don't slow down in that way, no. Stop running. Alright, okay. You ain't got your running boots on. Alright. <laughs> anyway, welcome back. Everybody's busy. Everybody's busy. Busy? Bruce! Say hello. Anyway, our Lee is plodding along on IV Co. Oh, I like, look at all the electric, it's fucking, there's wires everywhere, bro. The back, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Lighting overhead. Woo! Lights are in. Loads of lights. Fans are in. We've got lights underneath the garage bit. Bloody Nora! You put lights in there as well? Uh, There's lights everywhere! Ugh. Oh fuck. And then Uncle Bruce is working on the sprinter. Hello. What are you doing? Battling. Huh? Battling. I didn't ask what you're doing mentally, I asked what you're doing physically today. I'm trying to learn to scrub. Learn to scrub. I need to get some lessons. If only we knew a master carpenter on YouTube. If only we knew one of them. If only we knew anybody who was a master carpenter. Why are you not rising to it? Because I know a master carpenter. <laughs> he knows me, he knows me, he knows me well. He knows me well. This is the bulkhead for said sprinter and at the moment Bruce is doing the bed end and the reason why this is on here because we've got this cool little jig that Uncle Bruce made which I quite like he said he wanted clamps but I said it's not in this year's budget no, don't, don't point down right. so he's made these to clamp it all down <coughs> together and uh, all that business uh, because we've got a new tool haven't we yeah Still learning how to use a new tool, but we've got a new tool. We, we are trying to move on a little bit from pocket holes because they get a bit much, I'll be honest, like like on this that I'm making at the minute. But here's what it is. Uh, <coughs> I'm currently working on the Vario and we've got deadlines to get these vans out. Well, we've got a deadline for the Avico, but I'm giving myself the same deadline, even though this one's nearly done. Well, I said nearly done. The lighting's in now and it's it's so good because it's uh, warm white, so it's changed the entire look of this van. Like the woods just change colour instantly, which is bloody lovely. Just in that cupboard there, just the piece of wood that's on the workbench at the minute is the kitchen cupboard for here. And then I'm going to put a shelf across here to join those two together but because of this window, uh, we can't really put a proper cupboard there as such. And then I'm just going to replicate that kitchen cupboard up here. Andy has carpeted all of this area. It's difficult for you to see because it's dark. But he's carpeted all this area now so it all matches and all tied in together. And the, the electrics are pretty much done. Apart from just wiring a few things in. And as soon as I've done this cabinet area, then we'd start plumbing. And actually, I think we're going to take this one out of this spot very soon, get it outside and move the sprinter into this spot so it can have its main part of the build done. That's my loose plan anyway. Our Andy's not here today, he's, he's injured. Uh, he drilled into his hand randomly. I'm not laughing at that, obviously. That's not funny, I'm laughing at something else. But Andy's drilled into his hand. Show you many reasons, different seasons. Hop in my back and I stay in it. Hit from the back and I stay in it. He is not damn, don't play with her. She is not damn, don't play with her. I got a R O D. She got a P and C. Baby girl, you know you was made for me. Hop in my back and I stay in it. Hit from the back and I stay in it. She is not damn, don't play with her. She is not damn, don't play with her. I got a R O D. Right, 
So we've got a volunteer today. Come here. Say hello. Hello. Right. Phoenix is really naughty, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah. So uh, he's not allowed to play anymore. Why? Not allowed iPad anymore. Why? Gosh, you've got to work. Yeah. So he's got to work now, so we've got to make him work, haven't we? Yeah, and then we make money. Yeah, and what we're going to make? We're going to make £50 for holiday. £50 for holiday, okay? Yeah. But what are we, what are we going to build today? Uh, a cupboard. A cupboard, yeah. So we're going to make a cupboard right now? Yep. I got the tape measure and it needs to be that big, 43. Maybe it could be like so this. Well, I need to make a piece of wood to fit that now, okay? Okay, I'll... So I'll we're going to go to the workbench, haven't we? Workbench. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. Let's go. Why did not come out? You shouldn't let me put my safety goggles on. <laughs> Liam, I know you're going to be watching this because you're going to be editing it. And just so that everyone knows what you've just done, you're a prick. I was trying to do it under the toilet door, but you came out too quick. Right. You've got me good, but I came out of the fucking toilet. I know. Fuck off! <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Oh. So the buttons get connected and he pitches up. Are you having a laugh? Get out of the now, nah, you cunts! Alright, Lee. How did you fix the issue, Lee? Well, there's something new from Renager. Oh, yeah? There's a new thing from Renager. If you put their units to sleep for a little while, they wake up refreshed. And that's how I fixed it. He turned it off and turned it back on again. We basically took power off oh, my God coming in, power manager. off going out, and it decided to work. So that's crazy. So Another yeah, if you problem. if you've got a problem with energy, basically unplug it for a bit and plug it back in. Nice. I don't know. Can't breathe. I don't know. What are you doing today? Trying to clad. Huh? Trying to clad. Trying to clad. Yeah. I've got a clad. Right, so the Vario has got one week left. It's now Saturday. I'm in on my own, just doing some pottering about. But, now, as you can see, I've not even bothered turning the lights on. The Iveco, we've got a deadline of another two weeks. The so two weeks from Monday come in. The Vario, we're hopefully going to get out this week, this week come in. So by the next video, it should be completed. It's going to be a bit of a push now because I'm still waiting on some plumbing bits, but hopefully that'll work out all right. 
The sprinter is coming along all right, but the deadline for that is the end of this month, which is tight. It was always going to be tight, but I'm hoping that we can still do it. There's enough of us to do it. Ben is starting work Monday, so hopefully he can just hit the ground running and get cracking. We have got a few other jobs booked in, additional to these main jobs as well, which is a little bit, again, things are tight. But also today, another full build turned up, which wasn't meant to be until the end of the month, but he's asked if he can bring it sooner. So we don't have to start that, there's no pressure to start it. It's not until the beginning of November, that one really. But if we can, if we, if we have a quiet couple of days, we can get started on that. And it might be a good build for Ben to start getting his teeth into as well. So there is so much on. I'm excited though, I'm, I'm excited to see. I'm gonna move the Vario. I was meant to move it Friday, but I've just been so busy. The clutch has gone on my van, catastrophically just failed. So I don't have a vehicle. So far today I've spent £85 on taxes, which is not ideal. I'm trying to find another vehicle to use while I get the clutch done. But that's even that's proving hard. So anyway, I'll update you on that as and when that happens, but hopefully I'll have something by Monday. Hopefully we're gonna get the Vario out so the Vario can see daylight, we can get the solar working and tested and all that kind of thing, and then we can just bang the plumbing in. Bruce has just got a few little switches to fire up and all that kind of stuff. Then it's just a case of cleaning it out and it's out the door, hopefully by Friday. Then we can, I can start concentrating on the sprinter a bit more. Bruce is already working on the sprinter. Again, we've got Ben and Andy pottering about on the sprinter as well. So anyway, listen, we'll see what happens. <laughs> we'll see what happens. Thanks very much for watching this week's video. I appreciate it as always. If you haven't already liked and subscribed the video, please do that. It does help. Uh, and then share it with your friends as well. You might as well like, you might as well share it on Facebook or something. I mean, it doesn't cost out, does it? Support your local friendly van builder. Bye, Felicia.